So this just showed up, the Akmer K1 7 Watt Laser Engraver. It's fully enclosed and portable and promises to burn through wood, leather, and acrylic. But can this little laser engraver actually deliver? Let's find out. That had a lot of heavy foam in it and was really, really well packed. Inside we got our K1 unit, we have power cords, we got USB cables, we have our instruction manual. We got, uh, this is actually a connector for the vent in the back that's gonna go on it that you could add into like a uh, exhaust system. Um, we have our laser and we got safety goggles. We are definitely going to use these during the laser engraving process. There's also a few test pieces in here. I see some wood and it looks like acrylic. This unit, it's small, but it, it really feels very, very sturdy. I mean, I'm really digging the way this, this is set up and the way it looks. I'm actually really excited to test this laser engraver. Looks like we just need to take out our laser module and insert it right here on the head of the laser engraver when you set it up, this goes on top of the piece of material you're going to engrave. So let's just say we're going to engrave this wood. We're going to put this on top of the wood. Then we're gonna lock it in place. And that gives us our distance of the laser engraver on the wood. Setup only takes a few minutes. Plug it in, open the Acmar app, and you're ready. It's got 150 by 150 millimeter work area and the enclosed frame keeps smoke and light under control. I dropped in my Maker Build It logo for the first burn. Running seven watt power at 100 millimeters per second. Quiet operation, clean beam. The enclosure has a tinted safety window, which is awesome. Look at this, crisp edges, deep lines, and no char marks. Almost looks just like the real logo. How awesome is that? For its size, the Acme K1 is seriously impressive. Next video, I'm doing something D&D related on a different material with the Acmer K1. So make sure you follow. Oh, and also check out the link in my bio for the Acmer K1.